This video is intended to help with the consideration of content that requires the user to scroll vertically and horizontally. We always want to take into account how far it actually makes the user scroll from left to right. Scrolling further from left to right in order to access content uh, can present some difficulties. So let's take a look at how that actually presents itself. So I'm starting the sentence over here on the left. Edward Tuft is a statistician, visualizer, artist, taught data analysis and policy making at Princeton and Yale 32 years and also taught his one day course on presenting data and information to 328,000 students. So what just happened was I needed to drag my screen magnification window from this far left all the way over to the right. And then I had to find my way back over to the left to continue reading. You can see how the, I had to pause because I didn't really know where I was on the screen. You can see how that might cause a problem. I would also say that if I'm using a screen magnification tool on this website, that this is making this content below that in quotation marks down here is making me scroll a little bit far down. So I can read from left to right and it, that, that's a little bit better, left to right, not going as far. It's going to make me continue to scroll down to read this passage. So if we can ever find, I'm going to go to a different website, if we can ever find content that is a little bit more compact and kind of presented in a nice neat little package for us, that's, a, that's going to be preferable. So I'm going to look at... Uh, where the words that say English tutors get online tutoring from our expert English tutor. This is at dictionary.com, and it's a little advertisement here for tutoring help. So you can see, I'm going to get out of the screen magnification. This is kind of all presented in a nice little rectangular shape. That's going to work pretty well, typically, with screen magnification. And if I scroll through this website, that's kind of how kind of how a lot of the information is displayed, whether it's an advertisement or what I want to click on to find word meanings or word games. Everything's kind of in a little box. And that, that, that's really going to help someone that uses screen magnification. Here's a sentence that goes all the way across, almost all the way across. But very, very little of the content on this page makes me scroll from left to right all the way across. So you can see that the magnifier is going to pick up this bit of information. Then I would move on to the next piece of content. And it would be all right there for me. And I could move on to the next one. I would say that this works a little bit better if you can find something that is has the most of the content that is intended to be displayed kind of in one spot um, so that it doesn't make the user go too far vertically or too far horizontally. That would be preferable. 